Hello everybody and welcome to EXTREME COOKING I'm Chef Aerostorm and I'm going to teach you how to cook EXTREME Today we are going to cook tasty cupcakes These delicious treats can be the only thing that keeps the mood up during a long night of riping on easy bosses you killed the week before with ease Now if you are not cooking EXTREME you might buy the simple floor from the renter but since you do cook EXTREME we don't do that when you're cooking extreme, you get your own ingredients from the bottom. As such, we're going to get some corn. The best corn for your floor is found in Westfall. These farms are owned by nobody, since that's what hopers are, nobodies. Now you have to mill your corn. And what mill can be better than Terran mill? While I mill my corn, here's some historical cooking facts. Did you know that world PvP at Terran Mill started because a Alien player and a Hulk player tried to mill the corn at the same time? Now that we have our flour, it's time to get our northern egg. How do you get northern eggs when you are cooking extreme? Well, nothing beats chickens and nothing beats chicken eggs from the north, so nature blessed humanoid kind with bush chickens. These chickens may look odd, but they give you the best northern eggs in Azeroth. The best part is, you don't even have to breed them, since the vertical does this just fine for you. If you ask them nicely, they will gladly give you some of the eggs. Now we have some flour and a northern egg, and you might think we are done now, but you are thinking WRONG! How do you get some tasty cupcakes from some flour and an egg? You don't. It's stupid, and you ain't cooking stupid, you are cooking extreme, and when you cook extreme, you cook with sense. Therefore, we need sucker. Soccer is what puts the tasty in tasty cupcakes. You might wonder where you could get your own soccer from, but it's pretty simple. What do you like like soccer? In chains. What is in chains made of? Dust. Therefore, dust must be soccer in disguise. You can use any kind of dust slash soccer. But remember, the higher the quality, the better the cupcake. So I prefer to use hypnotic dust. Now we need chocolate for the cupcakes. You could get cocoa beans from the Dale Chris renders, but that is the wrong way to go. They come from a bag of imported goodies, and our extreme chef should cut out the middleman and import the goodies themselves. And the final thing we need is the small hearts on the top of the cupcakes. The only creatures with hearts small enough are gnomes and orcs, and gnomes are funnier to kill, and have small hearts for the right reasons. If you horde, you can queue up for a battleground and start slaughtering gnomes, and if you are alliance, you can just raid until your gnome comrades dies, and then loot them for their hearts. Did you know that Garrus was the first one to try using gnome hearts in tasty cupcakes and after he had tasted it, he declared that it tasted like chicken. Now that we have everything we need to make real tasty cupcakes, we go to a real kitchen with a real woman instead of making a campfire to cook it over because that doesn't make sense. And there you go, we now have tasty cupcakes cooked the extreme way. Thanks for watching and see you next time for some more EXTREME COOKING!